What is up you guys? Welcome back to our channel. We did so much stuff this weekend, like, oh my gosh, we got so much done. I'll go through and show you. Should I show you right now? I'll show you right now. So you probably saw on Instagram, we finally got our pantry doors done. I need to finish like organizing a few things in the pantry, but we finished that finally. And I think it looks so good. I'll place a before right here. And this is the after. We love it. it, looks so good. And then I don't know if you guys remember, we replaced these for like little green hooks and they were not big enough to like fit my purse and like things on them. So we replaced those with these gold ones and then we have the same cubbies underneath. And then remember how I've been literally complaining about the closet doors in our bedroom for literally forever. Also um, ignore this. This was a weird impulse buy, we hate it. So just like <gasps> pretend it's not there. We tore off the trim around our closet and we have closet doors coming they have to be custom so they are going to take what did he say 10 to 12 weeks a long time yeah. so it's going to be a while but we'll finally have closet doors Honestly, eventually i know this is dumb but it looks better without that wood trim yeah it just kind of felt like we were like half in a barn because like this didn't really match like the trim it's just and it was so not us yeah but like the way it is now even though it's unfinished it just i would rather it be unfinished and not be like not yeah us, you know anyway i'm so excited to finally have closet doors eventually because it's been driving me crazy i'm gonna make lunch really quick so that it's over and done with because maybe I can get it done before Harper wakes up and he can eat lunch right when he wakes up and then maybe we'll go do something fun. I'm not really sure what the day has for us, but <laughs> make sure to subscribe, follow us on Instagram, follow us on TikTok. Let's go ahead and get on into it because I'm rambling. Okay, also I have a confession. I've always said that I've hated mushrooms, but I cooked something with mushrooms yesterday that I saw on TikTok and it was delicious, amazing. It was a sandwich. Today I'm gonna make it into a salad, so that's what I'm making. So for all the times that I've said I hate mushrooms, I take it back, I was lying. What? Secret ingredient right? to making any vegetable taste good is garlic salt. I put it on zucchini and I'm putting it on my mushrooms and it literally made it taste amazing yesterday. Okay, whose so idea was that though? Yours, but <laughs> still a good idea. The other day I was driving and I drove past this little farm that's in our neighborhood and there's horses outside and sometimes we go like walk past it because it's close to our house and I saw one of the horses had a baby horse with it. I drove past quickly, I didn't get a good glimpse of it, I saw a baby horse and I said to my dear wife when I got home, there's a freaking baby horse over there. So we bundled up, we walked over there, the horse was no longer there. However, there were goats which looked like baby horses from afar. It was not a goat. And Guaranteed. Why, why would a mom a horse that just had why, a pony? Why do you think that they weren't both sitting in a stable? We can see the stable. No, not the ones they that were, were further away. You those see wasn't the same house, babe. Those I don't like that you're cars. waving a knife at me right now. <laughs> I'll figure it out eventually, and then I'm gonna rub it in Abby's face so bad. She's gonna so hate it. If you want to see if her neighbors Woo! actually did have a baby horse. Yeah, we'll see. It was definitely they had donkeys there one time, and so I think maybe you saw a donkey. Okay, well, where do you think the donkeys were just now when we were driving by? Maybe they got rid of them. Or maybe they're out at the vet. I Listen, don't know. I'm not saying that I am 100% that I saw it. I, it. There is a small possibility, but small. I think that I did see it if I had to pick one. And, and that's all I have to say about that. What's this? Is all this right. because of the horse? Yeah. I thought, you know what? I can't do this anymore. <laughs> it's the last straw. Wow. Why is that there? I'm cooking! I've got <laughs> juice all over me. <laughs> Originally when I made this sandwich, I did a bagel thin and then I did ranch and then I did provolone cheese, chicken, tomato, and then mushrooms on top. But today I'm doing lettuce and then the toppings. I don't have chicken because we were supposed to go to the store. Were we supposed to go to the store and pick up groceries? Julia went on the wrong day. Really embarrassing. So <laughs> It was really embarrassing. <laughs> they had to come out to the car and tell me, we don't have anything for you. You're going to so, But it's good because I really just don't like eating meat. And honestly, I don't really want to eat meat anymore. It's just like so hard when you eat meat your whole life like if you guys have switched from eating meat to like being a vegetarian or pescatarian let me know because i need some advice because it just grosses me out when i eat it i like never feel good ever since i was pregnant i like hated meat while i was pregnant besides like weird like bacon i don't know i had weird pregnancy cravings but i did not leave the fridge I, how many times a day do you think you do this um uh, probably like 20. Oh. Mm -mm -mm. the flavors are melting on my tongue isn't that a TikTok? <laughs> It's just so weird that I like mushrooms. I always thought that I hated them. I'm a new woman. You're a new woman. I'm new, new and improved. Wow. 
This is the final product. Oh, look at that steam. That looks so good. I wish I had something else to go on here. I was going to add avocado, but I don't think these are ripe yet. So this will do for now, but looks really good. I've literally been craving this since yesterday when we made it. So let's do a taste test of it in a salad. I had originally seen this on TikTok, like I said, but it was like a sandwich place. And I like commented and I was like, I need to know what this sauce was. And they just said that it was ranch, but their ranch looked better than store-bought ranch, but that's okay. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Mm. Mm, well. Look who woke up. We have some official news for you guys. We officially have a walker all by himself, unassisted. Is that true? I caught a video of it the other day. I'll post it here so you guys can see it. Come here. Come here. <gasps> Yay! Come on, you can do it. Oh my goodness. <laughs> but he took his first steps all by himself. <laughs> Like actual yeah. steps. You want to see? Do you want to do it for them? All right, sweetie. Can you walk to mommy? Go can you do mommy. it? I know you can. Yeah. Yeah. He might be a little wobbly since he just woke up. <laughs> come on, walk to mommy. Can you come here? Go to mommy. No. Oh, what the? <laughs> He's like, but it's easier. You want to take your bunny with you? Your papa. Want to take your papa? Yeah, All right, come mommy. here. Come here. Can I have it? Oh, good job! Oh, <laughs> Just one that. step. <laughs> He'll take like maybe five to ten steps himself and then he's kind of tired, huh? But you're just not in the mood right now, are you? Yeah, we'll try again later. I am so proud of you. You're going up so quick and you're doing all the fun things, but we gotta get you dressed. All right, are you ready to get dressed? <gasps> one, two, three. <gasps> oh my goodness. Yeah, this little bunny, this was the first toy that we ever bought him and I thought it was so cute. I wanna say I was like 10 weeks pregnant, honestly, maybe even earlier. And he loves it. He watches that little like hop, little bunny, hop, hop, hop song. And instead of hop, he goes bop, bop, bop. And I think it's so cute. So he got his little bop, bop. Where's your bop, bop? He say hop, little bunny, hop, hop, hop. Hop, little bunny, hop, hop, hop. hop. Oh, wow. You are so handsome. You, you. I know, I want to see if you can walk. Can you walk to the camera? Can you walk to the camera? Oh, it's almost, almost so close. So close. Go get him. Yeah, oh, so close. Harbor is now having a little snack. He got dressed for the day and then I figured he was probably hungry for a snack. So that was kind of my bad. I should have fed you and then changed you, right? But we bought a new high chair the other day. This high chair friggin' sucks. I hate it. If you see it on Amazon, don't buy it. I literally hate it so much. It's so hard to clean and he climbs out of it. It's awful. So I don't remember what brand this one is. This is the outside of it, but it's like all like hard. It's not like soft like this one because like food gets stuck and then there used to be these like cloth things right here. This is so disgusting. You can't get, you can't really clean in there fully. No, it's how really is gross. It, how are you supposed to clean in this tiny Right, and then little stuff gets or stuck in, in those crevices. Or in this crevice. Yeah. It's, it's dumb. So it's really unsanitary and gross, especially for somewhere he eats. I wanted to make sure it's easy to clean. So this one looked much better. Obviously, I haven't used it, so I'll let you guys know what we think. But that's the one that we went with. Yeah, so we're going to set that up and see how we like it over the next couple of days. I saw something on TikTok about how gays love assembling furniture. And it's the most accurate thing that I have ever heard. For me and i've been so excited for this to get here just so i can assemble it i don't know what about it, it brings me so much joy but i love it i am a little pissed off because it doesn't say the estimated time to finish this and i always try and beat that time so now i have nothing to compare my success to so that's a little frustrating but Maybe we'll link this in the description. What do you think, Abby? What? You want to link this in the description? I don't know. I haven't used it yet. Okay, let's let's do a side by side comparison of the two. Get your butt in here. Okay. All right, Harvard. Right, Here's the tea. What's the tea? Right off the bat, this looks like way better. I think this was cheaper. I think it was too. Okay. Wow. I like this actually. What do you what think? Do you think? Yeah. It is a little 
shorter, so you kind of have to bend yeah. over more with it. It's that much shorter though, like comparing this to uh, This one looks like it would be cuter. I agree with you guys, but it's just such a pain. It is a huge pain. Yeah. There's no weird crevices in this one, is what I like about yeah, it. Yeah, easy to clean. Yeah. 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 I think he likes it. What was that, six? I think that means six out of ten. Cool. You saw the verdict of the high chair, but now we're gonna go on a little drive. I wanted to like get out of the house and do something. Maybe we'll stop and get coffee or something, but we're gonna get in the car and go for a ride. Harbor is probably gonna watch some cartoons while we go. I would like to come back and fix his car because this broke down while we were outside trying it the other day. It's so random. Do you I don't know why that happened? I don't know, so weird. I have to take it apart. Yeah. Play oh, are there. you taking a pepper with you? Yeah, he was trying to be my snack. Oh, okay. He also got food on your shirt. You're crazy. Okay, You're crazy. Let's go. Do you in your car? Awesome. We go. Guess what happened to us the other day, guys? Someone drove past our house and then stopped. And normally I wouldn't notice this, but I happened to be looking out the window. I looked out the window and there's someone sitting there in their car, leaned out of their car, taking pictures of our house. Very weird. <laughs> Very obvious. They weren't even trying to hide it. They were like fully leaned out their door. We were like, we watched it on the security footage again. It was really yeah. Weird. And I don't know who it was. I have no idea what their deal was. They drove away right after that. But if that was you, Stop doing that. You're a weirdo. Why do you do that? It makes me feel weird. We bought a bunch of more security cameras after that too because it just makes you anxious. You don't know what their deal is, you know? So I bought a lot of security cameras. We were decked out. Yeah. I, I, did I show them all to you? Oh yeah, you bought a bunch of sensors. I bought a bunch of sensors, so if anything happens to any of the windows either, because I already had sensors on the doors, but not the windows, so now it's on the windows too. Anyway, I just seem so paranoid. Yeah. It, it's worse since we've had Harbor, because remember someone literally left a bullet on our doorstep and we like yeah, didn't do crazy. anything. <laughs> we got cameras after we that. Got, we did get one camera, but it barely worked and it, it was no good. It was really cheap. Yeah, but now someone takes a picture of our house and we freak out. I should have opened the door at noon. That would have been a good that idea. Such a good idea. Oh my oh gosh. God. That's the bad part of being an influencer is people for some reason like caring where you live and to invade your privacy. But the best thing I think that has ever happened in our influencing career, oh and I don't even know if this has to do with us, but backtrack, there's a TV show that Abby and I love. We've talked about it before. It's called Homework on Discovery Plus and they're local, they're like in Utah, so. The couple that does, they do home renovations and they have a style that's very, it's like ours, but way better. 10 um, times better. We could never. Yeah, we could never. So, but it's really a cool show and we get a lot of inspiration from it. And uh, they were getting canceled because someone posted a bunch of stuff hating on them. Listen, I don't know the full story, but we were mad because they were getting canceled and their show got canceled and it got taken off Discovery Plus and they decided not to renew it even though they had already been planning to renew it. Oh, we were so mad. I tried starting a hashtag. We started a hashtag to try and get them to come back. We were posting about it on our Instagram. And they were messaging us saying, hey, thanks. <laughs> <laughs> but we were like, we, like, we need this guys. show. Anyway, we, we actually did end up looking into yeah. why people were trying to cancel them. I mean, they like took on too much work at once and so they're like their quality of their work wasn't good, which is like unfortunate, but they're like paying back people and like doing all this stuff. So I'm like, okay, they're making their restitutions. Why cancel their show? You know what I mean? Also, but, how are we supposed to get any home inspiration? That's important. What about us? Okay. What about I gotta us? put me first. <laughs> I gotta put me first. Anyway, their show ended up getting uncanceled. I think, I don't know, is it on yet? I saw an article saying that they were gonna put it back on Discovery Plus, but then I yeah. never saw it on I Discovery don't, Plus. So. The, the, I saw the Magnolia Network released a statement saying that they're bringing them back on. Um, Where I'm, is it? I don't know if it is because of us. Probably. Probably. <laughs> Probably. <laughs> no, I don't think we made that big of a deal. But I do think that maybe it had some sort of effect on it. And if we can bring back our favorite TV shows, because we have followers on Instagram, that's the only thing I'm gonna use it for. Same, that's gonna be my even. only goal. <laughs> this is what Abby and I used to do back in the day. Um, we just get inspiration for houses. Uh, that house is still so abandoned. abandoned. Oh my gosh. Wow. I wonder if Andy and Candace are gonna get it. <laughs> Maybe we should make an Instagram post about that since you think we rule the world. <laughs> Okay, um... Yeah, Julia, that's a goat. <laughs> okay, but like from this angle, Same. it looks like no, it would be another horse. Now pull forward a little bit. Why would a brown we horse need the have reveal. a black and white <laughs> I don't baby? know. Da, 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 da. Yeah, it's a goat. That's embarrassing. It was a goat. I thought it was a horse. Yeah, well, I'm sorry about that. 
but you know what? I'm not sorry because I just got you to go on a nice little walk. And maybe that was my plan all along. Maybe I knew it was a goat. Maybe. But now I'm kind of disappointed because I wanted to see a baby pony. I know. Hmm. I am literally so embarrassed that <laughs> I thought all this time it was a baby horse. It's so embarrassing. And she even made a post about it on Instagram and I was like, no, Abby's lying to everyone. Uh, anyway, the moral of the story is always trust Abby and not me. If there's ever like a disagreement between the two of us, she's probably right. But that's pretty much it for today's video. Um, we don't really have anything else going on today. Thanks for watching. Bye.